Hey everybody, it's Jason Creel, and it's no secret that I've been long been considered one of the best dressed people in lawn care. People ask me on YouTube, they say, Jason, what kind of hat is that you wear? Jason, where do you get your shirt? Um, so today I thought, you know what, I'm going to take a video and I'm going to talk about um, head to toe, the clothes I wear. You don't have to go buy it if you don't want to, um, but I'll put links in the description to these products. And if you want to get something like I got, then go ahead. So let's start with a hat. These hats I order off of Amazon, and I've probably had several different kinds. And I just started wearing this one because my old one, I threw it in the garbage a few days ago. It was so nasty and dirty. I actually had somebody recently tell me, he said, Jason, that's embarrassing um, you wearing that nasty hat. So this is a new one. Okay, but when I, I put a link to the exact one I purchased. Uh, but what I do, I go on Amazon and I search for su sun hat with neck flap, okay? And then these, these pop up. They're cheap. They're like 15 bucks. And uh, lightweight. The neck flap obviously is huge. But the way, you know, well, get it. I mean, I wear sunscreen, but I'm trying to protect myself from the sun. And I'm also just, I, you know, I consider this my own personal shade tree. I mean, so when it's super hot like it is today, and I put this hat on, I think it's worth about 10 degrees uh, temperature wise, it feels like, besides having that heat beat down on my head. So I wear my hats, I don't wear them in the winter time, but when it starts getting hot, I'll wear this. All right, the shirts. I order my shirts from a place called epicsports.com, okay? Somebody told me about that. It's a place, it's like, I don't know if it's like discontinued sports merchandise or whatever, but you get pants, shirts, shorts things like that and i just look on there and finds one and this particular one um, just fits me well i got kind of a long torso so i don't like my shirts being too short okay and i just like the the look of this one so uh, what i do it you just order the shirts it's unbelievable customer service epicsports.com and then i get them printed locally okay so i just order the blank shirts and then my logo i go in there and i get it printed at a local screen printing shop pants okay and this is where i might need a little bit of help from you guys if i was going to change one thing about my wardrobe and i'll be honest with you i wear this about six days a week just be uh you know so maybe even seven occasionally um, but the pants i'm not crazy about them these are called blue mountain pants i get them from tractor supply they're about 15 bucks each they're okay okay they're not they're not terrible uh, i might get a year out of them I'll go buy like four pair one time. They, anyway, they're okay, but I wouldn't mind having something a little bit more comfortable, okay? They're not uncomfortable. Um, so anyway, if you've got suggestions on work pants you wear, then I would love to uh, hear from you on that. Um, socks, all I'll say about the socks is in the wintertime, I do wear thick padded socks. Uh, in the summer, I, I still wear fairly thick ones because I find when I wear thin ones, they just rub a hole in it. My only hot tip on socks is, and I've been telling people this for years, I wear black socks year round, all the time. It doesn't matter. The same socks I work in is the same socks I go to church in on Sunday. If the same kind, if I lose a sock, it's, it's okay because they're all black. I don't have to worry about finding the perfect match for this sock or that sock. They all look the same, okay? Match them up, fold them together, you got a pair of socks. Now boots. I have tried a lot of different pairs. Now, I do weed control and fertilization, okay? And you'll see these, these are the Muck Muckster 2, okay? And what's funny about these, and I'm gonna tell you a little bit about the boots, um, I've tried different brands. Uh, Dry Shot is a, a brand I tried that was a little bit more expensive, comparable to these, maybe even held up slightly longer than these. Uh, but I find the mucks a little bit more comfortable, okay? So I walk a lot. So I went with the Muck Muckster 2s, and this is pretty much my go-to now. Now, are they gonna last forever? No. With me out there walking so much, I might get six months out of a pair of boots. Um, but that, I'm okay with that. The weird thing about these is the, the, the price fluctuates big time on Amazon. I guess there's different people selling them. So I might have paid close to $100 for a pair. I might even got some for $40 something dollars at, at one time. It just uh, not just a few weeks ago, probably, I saw some for $60 something dollars. I went ahead and bought two pair, even though mine still got some life in it. You see the bottoms start to wear out. Maybe I drag my feet a little bit. 
Um, but to me, these are a great comfort. Uh, the, the rubber boots are great for spraying, and they're, uh, of course, waterproof. I got the ankle high ones. I've tried the ones that come up too tall, but they, they rub on my calves when I walk. Um, and I've heard other good brands, like I said, the dry shots are good. Uh, Bogs, some people talk good about those for spraying. And then, of course, the Cujos, maybe many of you heard those. Uh, I do have a link if you want to save a discount on your Cujos. I've got a pair of Cujos, and those are great for mowing, not so great for spraying because they're not totally waterproof, even though they definitely keep your feet dry much more than a tennis shoe. So there it is. I'm Jason Creel. This is my wardrobe. You don't have to buy this out, but if you want to check out these links, go ahead. I'll show you the link to the hat, the boots, the pants, and um, I'll give you the link to the website for Epic Sports. You just got to search around on there. They've got unbelievable deals. So hopefully this helps you out on uh, what you're wearing and your lawn care. I do think what you wear is important. One, you want to look good. You want to look professional. If you got a crew, you want them looking sharp. Uh, but also, just, you know, you want to be comfortable, too. So it's, it's both. It's that image. It's looking like you've been there, done that. Uh, and then also having something comfortable to work in all day. If you're thinking about starting a lawn business, go to LawnCareLife.com. Lots of resources there, video courses, documents for weed control, fertilization, mowing, mosquito spread. If you're thinking about going to the GIE Plus Expo this year, there's a half-off link in the description. It's an affiliate link. Early bird sign-up ends very soon, I think sometime in September. So use the link below. Early bird is $20, but if you use my link, you'll get $10 off. Or when you check out, just use V-I-P-L-C-F as your discount code. V-I-P-L-C-F. Talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye. Make it personal if you lose that customer that you wasn't really thrilled about having anyway. It's probably for the best of your company. If your employee quits, that was a pain anyway, celebrate it. That's probably for the best of your company. Try to replace him and don't look back. If that old jalopy of a lawnmower that you've been nursing along finally breaks down and dies, good. Now you can finally go and get something else. Yeah, it might cost more money, but get something. Think about what do I want my business to look like in five years, and let's start working toward that with the customers, with the employees, with the equipment, everything, moving that direction, and things that are holding back, we need to move on from them. So here I am, celebrating, because my business just got one step closer to the perfect lawn care business, and we're gonna celebrate like the Cleveland Browns just won the Super Bowl. <laughs> If you haven't done so, subscribe to the channel. I'll continue to provide helpful advice to you, hopefully in an entertaining way, to keep you engaged, but ultimately to help you grow a more successful lawn care business.